Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I am showing you how I made this simple card using all kind of stuff from Sugar Pay Designs. First of all, I die cut everything. You can see here some Nina Solar White 110. From Long Fun, you can see the Hot or Raspberry cardstock. The grey cardstock is from Gina K Designs and it's called Slate. And then you have the doll pink cardstock from Simon Says Stamp. So after die cutting everything, I decided to only put a small piece of white cardstock behind the doll pink type machine. Therefore, I'm using Gina K Designs Connect Glue. And next up, I decided to stamp out my sentiment. The type machine and the sentiment are from Sugar Pea Designs, You're My Type. So I'm stamping out the sentiment using Memento Tuxedo Black Ink and an acrylic block. Next up, I decided to continue with the type machine. So I'm adhering the slate cardstock onto the doll pink one using again Gina K Design Connect Glue. Next I decided to put some hearts on my letter as well as on my type machine. So therefore I'm using my quick stick tool to help me place everything on the right spot. And then I am gluing it down. Now I can put my letter inside my type machine. I first thought about using Gina K Design Connect Glue, but then I just took some some washi tape to adhere everything. And then I played around with the placement and decided to put it in the bottom right corner, placing some more hearts down. And then I decided to add some grounding, therefore I am using some Distress Oxide ink tumbled gloss. But before that I am going to mask the edges and then I will add another purple tape where I think the grounding should be beneath so that it is a straight edge. So Tapping off, dabbing off first my ink, then going to the cardstock to avoid those harsh lines. Peeling off my purple tape in an angle so that I can avoid ripping my paper. And then it's time to tear everything. So for the type machine I decided to use some thin foam squares from Scrapbook Adhesives. They are my favorite adhesive. Um, definitely because it is not that high because they are the thin ones and it's really easy to peel off the backings um, and then I am adhering it on top of my panel then the only thing that is left is adding those hearts using again Gina K Design Connect Glue and my quick stick to, to help me and this finishes my panel. So now I need to prep my card base. I stamped out my own stamp with Memento Tuxedo Black ink and then I creased this panel making it a, an American size card base A2. And then the only thing that was left was adhering the panel on top of it as straight as possible. So I used my permanent print adhesive tape roller to add some adhesive on top of it. It was not that easy because of course with the type machine it's a bit um, raised. Uh, but I managed and then I adhered it on the card base. And that finishes off my card. I hope you liked it. and. Um, 
Thank you for watching. I hope to see you next time. Bye.